Welcome to Radus Blackmail Reviews. This time it's double review, and this band is from Finland. It's called Kaestus, and here we have not only two reviews but also a giveaway. So stay tuned to the end of the review to find out what I'm talking about. This one features two uh, releases. First, the demo of 2021, a Nordic uh, Luciferian Discipline, which is technically speaking a demo with five tracks. And then we have the debut album from late 2021. That's the one was released in December, December, called The Undoer's Key. This is the full album, the debut album by the band. And then I have a special giveaway. Let's talk about that later. Uh, first, uh, let's talk about this MCD, which was released only uh, about nine months or so before the full album. This one features some very Nordic, very Finnish-like black metal and uh, five tracks all in all. Uh, this was less than 30 minutes in total length, so pretty basic uh, in that respect. And uh, the style is something that you could call kind of a intense, a little bit fast tempo uh, black metal with three guys here. Uh, sorry, two guys. There was third guys mentioned on, on Metal Archive site, but seems like he's not present on I, neither of the releases. But two guys present here, vexed from various bands, and the reason why I won't mention these other bands is related to the giveaway. And uh, then we have this full album, which is right here, with its... Um, little bit lengthier one this was roughly about 40 minutes if i remember correctly you'll get to see the information soon when i open the metal arc of site as backdrop and um this is more honed version of the same thing uh, with a little bit differences a little bit one could say um evolution progression with the band style here so once again two guys vex doing guitars bass recording and mixing and Scooter me on doing vocals and drums. So, about Scooter me on, there is no information, at least on my end, so can't really say what kind of a background he has. Maybe he has been part of some other bands, which I'm totally unaware of, but be it as it may, Wext then again has quite a few bands, a couple of own solo projects, and also some other bands uh, of more fame, which are worth mentioning, but Let's tune in for Metal Archives. So here on um, Kastus website or Metal Archives site, it shows three guys. But as it, as you can see on the uh, CDs I just presented you, the third guy isn't even uh, listed here on, on the CD. So I don't know what is his role really. Has it joined later on or what's the story? Doesn't really matter. It goes beyond the scope of this video anyway. Maybe during an interview one day, I hope to cover that. So Nordic Luciferian Discipline, five tracks, 24 minutes. And this is maybe the more versatile one of these two. It kind of has these different kind of ideas, more fast tempo parts, more melodic parts, more soothing down, and then again, a little bit more variety in general. And uh, as such, there are lots of nice ideas overall, but there are also ideas which kind of like feel like they don't really belong here. So in that sense, it's kind of a typical demo. You're figuring out what to do, which ways to do, even though the basics are, well, Finnish black metal, very kind of a Nordic black metal, if you will. Some of these ideas like are kind of overflown. Like say you have this box here and some of them just kind of like go over the fence and you're like, okay, let them lose. We don't re really need them on later on. While this one is definitely quite good of a start, I would say The Undoer's Key is definitely where the band kind of uh, found their focus. And this one is also 37 minutes, 9 tracks. Why I say also, I really don't know. But anyway, the point here is, now it's more focused in, in songwriting. That is, there are no weird leftovers, no experimentations at shots, but it's more focused when it comes to the vocal style, which is kind of raspy black metal vocals. There is some kind of a raw melodic output. So while, while I could say this is raw black metal, it's not super primitive, as you might think of, say, you know, Dark Throne, Panzer Force, or bands like Yildiarn, 
arm nut and so forth. But it's definitely on the raw end when it comes to melodic black metals. Because sometimes people like figure out, hey, it's melodic black metal. Yeah, it certainly sounds something like very Swedish, like, you know, Dissection or Mergrüning or Finnish band Seel und Viholinen and stuff like that. The kind of a more polished and nice sounding melodic black metal. But Kastus is more on the raw end of that. So while it's definitely melodic, it doesn't really, really sound like clean and crisp and nice and all that stuff. There's a certain amount of catchiness present, but it's not like the one of those cleaner styles. And that actually works for the favor of the band. Rather than being just one of many bands, now it has kind of like its own feeling to it, if you really get my idea. And I would say from the demo, the band has really stepped up. It's still not super great, but it's definitely moving towards, well, better direction, for the lack of better words. So I would say, if you start with the demo, you will see, or more like hear, the progression from the uh, early recordings and figure out how the band has been able to, you know, hone their style and make the overall recording a little bit better. Now, how the future will be for this two-man band, I don't know, but if this is the pace the band keeps, you know, evolving, then we will have a great album in the near foreseeable future. So whatever you start with, it's gonna be decent. It's gonna be good if you start with the later one and all that stuff. So I would say Undoer Ski is definitely the best. So if your time is very limited, start with that. But if you're keen to learn the whole story, check out the both ones. You will find links provided in the description box. And now comes the giveaway, uh, giveaway part of the video. Uh, this one, this A5 size version of Undoer Ski will be given away to some lucky one. And the question is, can you name one other, you don't have to list all of them, one other active band by Vexed that is happening? Meanwhile, Castus is right there. You have three days of time to uh, reply to the request. And so this coming out on Monday, you have all Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. So technically speaking, three and a half days of time to get your reply and then I will call it off and uh, announce the winner who will get this A5 size version of the CD sent by me, sent by yours truly, like the saying goes. So uh, in case you want to win the CD, just put down your uh, comment on the YouTube videos comment section. Don't comment on Facebook uh, because I most likely will forget to check out the reply on that sense. So comment on under the YouTube video with your best guess or knowledge, piece of knowledge you have. What is one of the other active bands by Vexed? And you have the chance to win this beautiful A5 size Digipack. And those who won't be winning, well, check out the music through the band's Bandcamp sites or go for the physical product, as I always say. And uh, what can I say? Enjoy! the goddamn music. Rauda out. Take care. Bye. Bye.